Hey YouTube, it's Emmanuel from Tech Insomnia. Today we're going to be unboxing and reviewing this absolutely gorgeous brand new M1 MacBook Pro. So the one I have here today is a M1 Max MacBook Pro. It's a 16.2 inch screen in the space gray color. Comes with a 10 core CPU central processing unit. 32 core GPU graphics processing unit, 64 gigabytes of internal memory, RAM, and a monster 8 terabyte SSD. This is an absolute beast of a MacBook Pro. Okay, time to get this beautiful brand new sealed MacBook Pro open. Oh, that didn't go too well. <laughs> This is honestly one of the best parts. Nothing better than a brand new Apple computer. Packaging is always very, very well done. So this one looks like it's the sliding top. Absolutely incredible. Really, really nice computer. I love how Apple always knows how to package it so perfectly. Of course, we've got this gorgeous MacBook Pro here. Box and accessories. Charger, charging cable. Very, very nice. Always incredibly packaged. Gorgeous. Wow. Look at those vents. Absolutely gorgeous computer. Incredible lines. Just a beautiful machine. Got the rubber mounts here. Classic Mac design. The eight torque screws. is the classic Mac sound. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous computer. Beautiful. <laughs> Very nice push, and I could feel slight, uh, slight vibrational feedback. To use English as the main language, press the return key. They've got a really, really nice new type of setup, I guess, for um, Monterey. Two finger scroll. Very, very nice. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, set this computer up. Okay, so the first thing I want to say about this Mac is it is absolutely gorgeous. The design, the lines, the edges, just immaculate in every sense of the word. Keys, the trackpad, screen, I mean, <laughs> it doesn't get much better than this. If you're an Apple fan, this is definitely something to aspire to. What an incredible computer. So one of the first things I feel like we gotta do on this Mac is a boot test. Very curious to see how quick this thing boots up. Oh 
Wow. 20 second boot time. Now this is the exact MacBook Pro that we're looking at today, which is the 16 inch 2021. It's got the Apple M1 Max CPU, 64 gigs of RAM. Monster. Eight terabyte internal SSD. Bonkers. <laughs> so this is Windows 11 running on Parallels. And we're just gonna do a quick SSD benchmark test for the internal SSD in this computer. Absolutely insane. This is a crazy read write speed for an SSD that ships with any MacBook Pro. Literally one of the fastest I think I've ever seen. Bonkers. Okay, so let's check out the internal Wi-Fi card speed. 10 gigabits per second. <laughs> now it's reading 10 gigabits per second only because we're Parallels, which is running Windows 11, is using the network connection via Wi-Fi. So I'm connected to an Asus Wi-Fi 6 router right now. This thing is fast. Like, really fast. Actually, almost ridiculously fast. Um, okay. Let's test out Google on the Mac side. So I'm just gonna type in some random searches. Let's go cooking. No hesitation. Let's go technology. Oh, spelled that wrong. Still came up quick. <laughs> Nature. Computers. Fast. Like, really, really fast. Go over to YouTube. It's one of the fastest <laughs> I've seen YouTube open. Let's play a video. Let's go for this one. Hey, YouTube. So a little above 1080 and between 4K and 1080 is its default, I guess, uh, video playback. Let's go over to 4K. Like, no hesitation. And this is 4K. Let's see a quick little full screen. This is a great way to test out your graphics card. Stream 1080 or 4K video and just minimize and maximize the video while it's playing. And look for lag, look for hesitation in the playback while it's transitioning from default screen size to full screen. I mean, this thing is not struggling at all. This is a monster of a computer. One of the fastest MacBook Pros I think I've ever seen. Back on the parallel side, we'll do the exact same test. So this installation of Windows 11 on Parallels is set to use four cores of the CPU in this computer and eight gigs of RAM with I think 256 gigs allocated to the storage. So let's just open up Microsoft Edge and um, we'll perform the same test. We'll just do some random searches. Um, let's go cooking. Fast. Nature. Houses. 
Attack. I mean, for the most part, using um, Windows 11 on Parallels, it's been very fast. Like, really fast. Like, I haven't noticed any hesitation. Um, I've installed uh, Windows 10, Windows 7, Parallels on numerous computers over the years. And there's always, like, you know, a little bit of lag. It's never... It's never comparable to, let's say, the true um, Windows experience on a PC. But, I mean, this is something else. <laughs> I've never experienced a Mac quite as powerful as this computer. So we're going to um, let's test out 4K on um, the parallel side on Windows 11. So we're streaming 4K right now. Let's do that same graphics card test. Even almost slightly, ever so, just a tiny bit more fluid, in my opinion. Transitioning from default to full screen. I mean, there's no like, it's as quick as I can literally get the mouse to that area of the screen like there's no hesitation this computer is an absolute beast and that's at 4k that's not even 1080p if i go to 1080p and try the exact same thing i mean it's it seems just a tiny bit faster but you can't even notice it <laughs> the graphics card in this thing is an absolute titan all in all, that pretty much sums up my review for this 2021 Apple MacBook Pro with the M1 Max CPU. I wanted to keep the video simple, not get uh, too crazy. I'm sure there's a lot of other tests that I could have performed on this computer, but I wanted to keep it simple um, for the average user to kind of see what the computer is all about. Very powerful, very strong. No hesitation. I'm sure that this thing would be incredible for um, video production, editing, rendering, bouncing, pretty much anything that you could do with a computer. This is definitely one of the most powerful laptops I've ever gotten my hands on. <laughs> I hope you guys found value. If you did, please do like and subscribe and stay tuned for more tech review, tech related videos to come in the near future. Appreciate all the support. Thank you guys so much. Stay safe out there and I'll definitely see you in the next one. Till then, have yourself a great day.